Selia Land Spots was the first waterfall that we visited on day 4 and it's a very famous waterfall due to the fact that you are able to actually walk behind it. It drops 40 meters over the cliffs of the former coastline, also now known as a relic cliff, and is located between Selfoss and Skagafoss. The waterfall has many classic waterfall features such as a plunge pool on the Kote and a wave cut platform among others. Skagafoss, the second waterfall we visited, is a waterfall situated in the south of Iceland at the cliffs of the former coastline and one of the biggest waterfalls in the country. It has a width of 25 meters and a height of 60 meters. After the coastline had receded seaward from Skagar, the former sea cliffs remained parallel to the coast, creating a border between the coastal lowlands and the highlands of Iceland. According to Icelandic legends, the first Viking settler in the area bur buried a treasure chest in the cave behind the waterfall, which locals later found. However, they were only able to grasp the ring on the side of the chest before it disappeared again. It is believed that, the ring, that this ring was given to the local church and is now in a museum, but it is, it is doubtful whether it gives any credence to the legend.